Give I this wisdom, free may ye be, O man, living in light and in brightness. Turn not thy face from the light. Thy soul dwells in realms of brightness. Ye are a child of the light. That's your hero, because he never gives up. The odds are stacked against him. He strives to accomplish his task, his goal. First one we're looking at here, everybody knows Poseidon, God of the sea, right? But how many people know that this very being is tied all the way back into the Sumer story in the cuneiform tablets with multiple names. Right, so as soon as you see one of these characters going all through these cultures, you go, wait a second, how could any one of them live that long from Sumer all the way to Rome, okay? How's that possible? So what you're witnessing right here is the, is the creation of the very first avatar. That's right. In my opinion. And, and nothing has changed since then. We're all avatars when we finally realize this. The idea that Enlil's son was the moon god of the Muslim world should not surprise people if he's the god of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. So that anything that can be done to affect the five senses, irrespective of your other aspects of you, your energy body, your chakras, dragon with wings stretching across the sky and light streaming in all directions from its body. Now, haven't we all been taught that's an evil thing, the dragon, right? Oh, okay. Okay. Everything is, 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 it seems is a perversion of something that was good. Everything. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Well, this is like, keep in mind, this is one of the oldest extant writings from Hermes. Welcome to the Seventh Planet Broadcasting Special Series, the Anunnaki. Thoth is often connected to the Greek god known as Hermes. In the story of the Garden of Eden, Adam and Eve give birth to two male children known as Cain and Abel. Enki was the actual father of Cain with Eve, while Abel's father was Adam. Looking at Noah's genealogy table, we see that he and his wife bore three sons, Shem, Ham, and Japheth. Looking at the various statues portraying the Greek god Poseidon, it seems very clear they look just like us. That for those that are seeking truth, and are willing to do the disciplined work to get there, you will be protected. He will guard your, you from your lower nature. I, I've known for a very long time that my energy is eternal. At least as far back in the records as I can see, these two have been playing light and dark. And it's by, it's by design, okay? Exactly. It's part of creating the duality in the simulator for the creator of all. 